Accounting for depreciation, how will you account the depreciation in your books? Method 1 where you are going to directly adjust in the asset account. Directly adjust in asset account. Okay. Asset account will adjust under the other asset and you get a bit of asset. Wrong about the asset account debit to buy. Other couple and asset and you get the use for number the value reduction on the end of the asset. Reduce money use for the pun and the assets are value for either the other reduce money. Isn't it depreciation to asset? Or there is one more thing. Asset is normal. Asset to bank is depreciate. Asset is adjusted through adjusted through provision for depreciation account. Provision for depreciation account. Provision for depreciation account. Is that okay? Up, uh, while depreciating, you are going to debit uh, depreciation and uh, credit to the provision for depreciation account. Asset a paid credit for the money, provision for depreciation account and credit for it. That's the process. Read the model. Sometimes later you may sell the asset, right? If an asset, sometimes later you plan to sell. You plan to sell. Okay. Up a sale for number the episode. So we can sell directly. We can sell directly. Another sales amount of direct assets are complete. Okay. Model one. Okay. Directly adjusting, directly adjusting or directly close asset, asset data close money. Of course, uh, rather than this way, we have one more route, which is nothing but, which is nothing but. Rooted through asset disposal account. Okay. Through asset disposal account. Asset disposal account. Okay. The same process may come. The same process may come. In this case also. In this case also. Okay. Clear? You have to understand this clear. So, let me now solve an illustration under the first model, first subdivision. In the model, solve any correct? Okay, so you have to be master with the, this item, that is how to handle in case of accounting that in our books. Original value of the asset, original value of the assets being 65,000, scrap value being 5,000 rupees and uh, life of the asset being 4. Method of depreciation being SLM. SLM, right. And note, note, asset sold, asset sold for rupees 10,000 at the end of third year, third year in. 
at the end of third year it is so clear now let me see here calculation of amount of deposition amount of deposition at SLM method is equal to original value minus scrap value divided by life in years original value being 65,000 scrap value being 5,000 life being 4 years so amount of deposition here being 15,000 per annum even you can calculate the rate of deposition also where amount of deposition divided by original value in percentage. 15,000 is the rate of means the amount of deposition divided by original value being 16, 65,000. The value in percentage being how much? 23.08. Right. Now accounting. Passing the journal entry, okay. Passing the journal entry. See, under the first model, accounting for depreciation, lower the asset, wrong about the entry, okay. You are purchasing the asset, no. So, for that, the entry being asset account debit year one, so year one year 1 at the 0th period you are purchasing the asset so asset upon debit to bank to bank the value of asset being 65,000 the value of the asset being 65,000 ok by the first year end, we are going to depreciate the asset. Depreciation can entry. Asset value reduce the so you are going to reduce the asset's value by crediting the asset account directly adjusted. Directly adjusted. Okay. So depreciation account debit to asset account to asset account. The value of uh, depreciation in the very first year 15 as it is being SLM. Year after year, the amount of depreciation being the same 15,000. So 15,000, 15,000. The later the depreciation is uh, expenses, right? Hereafter, not required to carry over the next year. So uh, the PNL account number transfer, you know, so it should be debited to the PNL account. PNL account debit. In the debit to depreciation. To depreciation. The value being 15,000. 15,000. So the life being 4, so you have to repeat this for 4 years. Any of third year level with the row, other than third year, work, then I repeat for now. Second year, end in our row. Again, the same. Third year inlet, again the same. There is no any complications. Year on year, you are going to repeat the same journal entry. This is for the second year, this is for the third year. Okay. In case of a WDV method of Irundal, the amount of deposition will be different, but the formula is the same. Formula is the same. The journal entry will be the same. But the third year end. We sold the asset immediately and the asset with it on the third year end line. We can both end up on the program. Again, we sell directly. We sell directly. Okay. Other assets are going to be the asset credit control. That's the logic. In the third year end, while selling the asset, the journal will be we get the money right. So by the time. Bank account debit, bank account debit. Bank account debit to asset account. How much I am getting? The asset is sold for 10,000. I get 10,000 rupees. 
What is the value of the asset as per our books? Book line value work in the asset. Hmm? What is the value of the asset as per the books? We started with 65. Year on year, you have depreciated 15,000 rupees. As such, now 3 years over 315,000, 45,000 were depreciated. From 65, 45,000 is depreciated, means today it's only 20,000. But while selling, we got only 10,000. Book value only, and the company has a loss. So you can directly debit the loss. Loss on sale of asset. 10,000. This is what about the accounting of uh, deposition. So, what did I follow here is direct adjustment in asset account while uh, depreciating and while selling is also directly adjusted. So, this is the format I have followed. Is that clear? Now, now. We better prepare the ledger also. We better prepare the ledger. In the ledger account, we have to do asset account, depreciation account. Bank account table, we have to do the bank account table. We have to do the account extract. Extract is a format. We have to do the account extract, not complete PNL account. So, predominantly, you may be asked to prepare. Asset account, nominal account, deposition being the nominal account, yeah. And the year close on the close item, it will be nil balance. Okay, year close on the nil balance. Up in a deposition create money and the deposition pay will be transfer money and deposition will be zero. Right. Let's try now. Let's try now. So, what are the account I am going to open? Asset account. Asset account. Very first year we purchased, right? So, two bank. Two bank. This value being 65,000. By closing the first year, we reduced the assets value by 15 due to the usage named as depreciation. In the lower mode, buy depreciation for the first year, buy depreciation. The value being 15,000. First year over, over or so, account of prospect or no, asset being the real account, it will have the balance carried over for the next year. 65,000. 65,000. Okay. 50,000 being the balance here. Balance carried on. Balance carried on. Transfer to the next by balance brought down. This value being 50,000. 50,000. Is that okay? If we have a second year program, asset account is not going to be correct. Okay, two balance. Okay. So, second year, carry for number two, again, assets for that value reduction is there, depreciation, by depreciation. By depreciation. The value being 15,000. If I close this, 35,000 will be the balance. Okay. 35,000 is the balance. Balance carried. And then the third year, again, two balance brought. Two balance brought. The value being 35,000. In the third year also, it is depreciated. 
So by depreciation for the third year, the value being 15,000. If you tally this, but of course by the end of third year, the asset is sold off. So sales is a transaction in the asset with. If the record on both the opposite side of the buy bank, we sold it for 10,000. So 35 minus uh, 15, today it's worth to be 20, but sold only for 10, less than the book value. Whenever we sell at the lesser value, it may be loss, otherwise gain, otherwise it's a gain, but here it's a loss. Loss of sale of asset, 10,000. Hereafter, we don't have the any assets. So the asset account becomes nil now, 35,000, 35,000. Then after this, it is better prepared for depreciation also. Depreciation is a nominal account. Adala year end la depreciation will have no balance. Okay, balance sheet la pair other. In the very first year, depreciation to asset, right? So two asset no put together, the value reduction of the assets due to usage. Value being 15,000 by what happens the same year that deposition is transferred to the PNL account. So, by PNL account, very good. 15. If you tally, then the deposition will have no balance. It will balance it. Cut. Asset on the balance of the real account will have subsequent years usage. All the nominal accounts are closed and the balance is transferred to the trading and PNL accounts of closed. Second year also the same you are repeating, two asset, two asset 15, buy p and account, buy p and account 15, it gets closed, it gets closed. The last year again we repeat the same way, two asset account, asset account, buy p and account. 15,000. Can we prepare the PNL account, sir? Of course, you can PNL account porting, na, the PNL account extract. I will tell you, I will complete PNL account for the other. PNL account extract. Only a path. Theo Pata. In the very first year, PNL account la two depreciation. You can see the final accounts, but you can see the depreciation at the sale of the this is for first year and you have to carry on the next PNL account. Over or some on the PNL account, deposition will appear in the debit side along with the other items also, right? So, we have completed uh, this method, direct adjustment of the assets uh, value reduction to the asset account. On sale, asset account is reduced. So, this model is over. This model we have completed. Clear? Now, come on, finish up copying this.